Hi, I'm Paul Seal from CodeShare.co.uk. A few days ago, uh, someone who did the YouTube series that I did for um, making an Umbraco site and the second series where I built this site, I Love Lashes, they asked me how do they get alt text onto the images. Um, so I, what I said was I'll do a quick video for her. So this is the video for you so you can see uh, how we do this. So um, let's have a look. When she says about alt text, she's talking about on the image tag, we want some alt text here. So first of all, I'll just show you what we need to do. So I added a new property. So I logged into Umbraco, I went into settings, I went to media types, and then image. I added a new property to image called alt text. And that's the alias there, alt text uh, with a capital T. So I added that to all images and then when you've got your image I then made sure that that's completed on the image. This is some alt text. So now the alt text has got that value and then on the actual template where I get the image, so I've got I publish content main image. So I get the image from the current content item then what I can do is I can get the value from that main image by doing get property value, um, angle bracket string, and then alt text inside the open, uh, round brackets. So that gets me the main image alt text. And then lower down, when I use that, I can just do at main image alt text. So it's as simple as that. So it's just literally, it's a property now on the uh, image, on all images that are within the media section anyway. Uh, the other thing just to point out is that if you're doing it within content, so let's say I've got some content here and I have an image, well, you have the opportunity to put that in there. So let's choose this image. So you have the opportunity to add alt text here. So here is the alt text. So I can submit that and save and publish. So now if I view this page, we'll see, there's the image. If I inspect that, here is the alt text. So when it's, a, when it's an image that is within the, um, within the content editor, that's how the alt text is added. So even though it has it on the image that you picked, doesn't come from there it comes from whatever gets added at that point in the content so the alt text property is only used wherever you render in it from within your template or partial view so i hope that answers your question and i uh, hope that's helped anyone else out who followed along with the course and they wondered the same thing about adding alt text to their images um, so thank you for watching if you liked it please click on like subscribe to my channel and share with others Thanks a lot. Bye.